first one is a very simple split screen comparison. Assuming that you've already graded your clip, the next thing you're going to do is to duplicate it. Press Command C and then Command V. Place the duplicated clip on top of your first one. Select the bottom clip, head over to the video inspector and then disable the entire set of effects by clicking here. Select the top clip, bring up the effects browser, in the search bar type in draw mask and then double click on it. Zoom out 25% from the footage. For this example, the right hand side is going to show the before grading and the left would be the after grading. Choose your first point, preferably outside the footage. Hold shift to draw a perfectly straight line down the middle for comparison and then finish it off by drawing a box. Under draw mask tool, go down to control points and then click this arrow to drop down the menu. Set point 1 and 2 in the x axis to 0 and then you're done. For the second one, I would like to call it the color emerge effect or emerging color effect, I don't really know. Same as before, duplicate the original clip by pressing command C and then command V on your keyboard. Place the copied clip on top of the original one. Disable the effects in the bottom clip. Skim through the clip and find your starting point. Back to the inspector, under the compositing tool, reduce the opacity all the way down and then add a keyframe. Choose your endpoint for the effect and bring the opacity back to 100%. And there you have it. Last but not least, the classic swipe or wipe, I guess. At this point, you're probably a pro at copying and pasting clips. Same as before, duplicate your clip by pressing Command C and then Command V. Place the copied clip on top of the original Select the bottom clip and then disable all the effects once again. Bring out the effects browser and then search for draw mask. Drag and drop it right onto the top clip. Zoom out 25% from the clip. Find the starting point of the effect for your clip. For this tutorial, I would like it to go from left to right. Find your point, preferably areas outside the clip. Hold shift to draw a perfectly straight line. And then once again, draw a box around half of the clip. Drag this first and second point line out from the footage. Under Draw Mask tool, add a keyframe to the control points. Go back to the clip to find and choose the end point. And then drag the same first and second point line across so that it covers the entire clip. And here's the result. These effects work well for both standard and log footage. So please feel free to experiment with it. And that's all I have for you today. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you find this tutorial somewhat helpful. And if you did, please leave it a like and also subscribe for more short Final Cut Pro tutorials like this one. Good luck with your project and have a wonderful rest of the day. Bye bye.